Hello, hello, I'm Plasmatical, and today is the third day of Inktober. Our prompt for today is Vessel. Alright, so right out you can see that I drew a simple figure, but it's incomplete, like those old Roman statues that have worn down and lost some limbs. But additionally, it's got a grand pair of angel wings surrounding it. First things first, I outline the body. Nothing complicated. And to continue, I get the main backing of all four wings in place. From there, I have the oh-so-fun task of outlining all those individual feathers. A note, you can probably tell that the lines are not very neat and pretty shaky. Not super appealing to look at. And that's totally fine for this piece. I'm going for a more stylistic approach today, and all I need right now is a base for what I'm going to do later, where these original lines aren't going to be an issue. So it took a while, but all those feathers are done and now I can get to the fun part, where I'll really make the piece pop. Using my thickest pen tip that isn't just a straight up brush or chisel, the .08, I first go around the outer edges to get a nice thick border. But I go in and really clean things up, making it look not just neat, but really smooth as if it all flows together. I achieve that by connecting the inner corners of the beginning and end of each feather. It gives a rounder edge which is just nicer to look at and it elevates the piece as a whole. There isn't any fancy coloring in or shading for today, I really just wanted to focus on the stylistic line art instead. Okay, so the borders are done. I'm really liking it already because nothing is uniform other than the actual wing pattern. It looks so cool like this, I'm definitely going to be using this technique more in the future. But right now I'm going to take a break from all that and add some color dimension. I say color dimension, but really it's just a slight fill on the wing backbones. Nothing fancy, just hatching to make those areas darker. At first I had the lines spaced out by a few millimeters, but I wanted them darker so I went back and added another line in between each set. From there, it was just a matter of applying the same method as earlier to the rest of the wings. Well, the bottom edges of each layer of feathers anyway. Doing it to every single outline of every feather would just make everything uniform again, which is the very thing I'm trying to avoid, so I just stick to the bounding lines.
And oh, tell me this doesn't look sick. I love how today's piece came out for real. I didn't expect to have so much success with the new lining method, but ooh, it totally works out. Alright, so that's it for today. The prompt of Vessel really shines here with the angel wings sort of overpowering the figure. Hope you guys liked it, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.